Raquel Jensen is a PhD student at University of Southern Denmark at the Faculty of Engineering. My PhD project is about field robotics, and I focus on the navigation and control system for these field robots. Basically, I'm together with my group, I'm trying to, uh, to create a field robot that drives more accurately and more robust than a human driver would be capable of. This way, we can actually perform some very precise tasks in the field, like for instance, killing weed or finding landmines. Kjell Jensen spends most of his working hours at the laboratory and in the farmland, where he tests the agricultural robots. He also spends time working in disaster areas, offering his technical skills and expertise to engineering, both farming and humanitarian aid alike. I believe the most interesting part about being a PhD student is that you get to challenge really hard problems. And if you find a solution to them, you, you, in the end you can change people's way of living. In my research, I focus on su sustainable food production and on humanitarian demining using those field robots. If we can change the way we produce food to a more sustainable way, if we can clear fields of landmines, then we can really make a difference. University of Southern Denmark has a total number of approximately 1,000 PhD students spread over five faculties. The university offers a strong international scientific environment with a large variety of research fields. I think one of the most interesting things about being a PhD student here at the University of Southern Denmark, and in particular at the Faculty of Engineering, is our huge interdisciplinary collaboration between all researchers. Here at RoboLab, our robotics laboratory, I can find areas of expertise in design, in mechanics, in electronics, in uh, computer science, in programming, and robotics, and so on. And this makes it much easier for me to perform my research in applied robotics.